Next up on our list of enhancements here, we have the Convert to Black and White. Now this is similar to that last dialog box with the Adjust Color, except here we're choosing the style of black and white we want to work with. We have infrared look right there. Again, this is our after. A newspaper look, portraits look, landscape look, urban snapshot. There's one just off screen there as well. I think the, the scenic or the urban snapshot, maybe the scenic, gives me the best view. And once you've done that, you can come down here and you can adjust this. You can adjust your reds, your greens, your blues. And there's also a contrast right there. I think a little more a little more contrast maybe. maybe not quite that much and we can lighten up the red tones the greens will leave about where they were the blues are mostly in the highlights as you can see here So you can play around with these controls until you get the best possible rendition of this into black and white. If you want to start over, just go back to one of these initial settings and then you can start over again at that point to again try to find just the exact right control. And it's a great way to come in and convert to black and white, giving you a great degree of control over the conversion of colors into the black and white or gray scales. When you're done, just click over here on OK and there's your conversion to black and white.